Hey, what's up, guys? It's Preston here, and as promised, I'm going to do a 200,000 subscriber special video with my mother. And uh, we're picking that, you know, we're picking questions from Twitter and Facebook from you guys. And yeah, so here's my mom. I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen her in my streams. Maybe you haven't. She's kind of crazy. Anyways, you want to introduce yourself? Hi, my name is Jay. With a, with an E at the end. It's uh, it's it's strange. Anyways, so we're gonna look <laughs> at your questions. Uh, first one is, do you want to read this one, mom? Okay. So we'll jump right, right, right into it. Okay, to Preston's mom. When friends of yours ask, what does your son do for a living? Do you say he plays video games? You should just tell him I'm a nerd. Uh, yeah. Well, a this, is, <laughs> this always gets like the eyebrow crazy look when I tell them that he uh, is a YouTube commentator and plays video games for a living. And they look at me and go, yeah, right. And I'm like, no, he really does. So anyways, I try my best to explain it. Not so easy sometimes, but it is what it is. I wouldn't believe you. I'm just, I'm just saying. <laughs> nobody, nobody should play video games for a living. It's just it's crazy talk. Amen. Anyways, next one is TB and our mom. What was it like raising a Preston? <laughs> raising basically a the best <laughs> Call of Duty player in the world. Yeah, what was it like raising, raising a, a, a self prodigy? Um, it was wonderful. Um, we have had an amazing 18 years together. He was a, a super easy, greasy baby, and we just he was an awesome toddler. He was stubborn to the core. When he was three, he decided he was going to learn to ride a bike. And his dad and I sat out on the back of a car and for eight hours on the gravel out at his grandpa's, uh, TBNR Frag's grandpa. Um, he took that bike and he rode it around and he'd fall off and he'd cut his legs and arms. And we just sat there and it took him eight hours. And at one point, he picked that bike up over his head and threw it and chunked it as hard as he could. But at the end of the day, he learned to ride a bike. <laughs> so. And that answers your questions if I've ever raged as a child. Yeah. I definitely <laughs> yeah. I had my fair share of rage moments. But he's always been a wonderful, wonderful kid. All right, next question is, has Preston ever cursed in front of you? This one is going to be good. <laughs> it's a, this is a good one. Because people know I don't swear on my channel because, like, I don't need to because I can be funny without swearing. And not only that, but it's kind of, like, pointless because, like, it's, I don't know, it's kind of easy to be funny if you swear. Because it's just, like, swear words are just funny. It's just, they just are. And, but, and anyways, basically, uh, I had to get my wisdom teeth removed. And this was, like, when I first started YouTube and streaming. I was only doing zombies back then. And we went to the, you know, get my wisdom teeth removed. And the only thing I remember is... I'm not falling asleep yet, and then I, I'm out cold, and then I wake up, and I'm so drugged up, uh, my mom's, like, talking to me, and what was I saying? He said, she keeps calling me Tristan. She Tristan. She keeps calling me Tristan. I'm like, she's calling you Preston, and then he kept trying to pull the IV out of his arm, and I kept telling him, stop it, and he, they were, and he said, they can't do anything to me. They can't do anything to me, and next thing I know... He was sending out all kinds of blankety blank 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 words and I was telling him, Preston, <laughs> behave, you need to stop it, you're embarrassing. And he just kept going on and what, on. What, you can't know when you're, when you're like, I think they put the morphine, right? You know, it's funny. We laughed so hard. I just, I, I couldn't I know, she laughed. breathe. It was I hysterical. Know. Anyway, I came back that day and streamed for people in my zombie stream, like 20 people. And everybody was like, Preston, why aren't you talking? And I'm like, I heard I have a my, my tooth. I have my tooth wait, wait, wait. And by the way, I told him not to do that because for those of you who know, you get things called dry sockets. And because he chose to come right back and start doing commentating, he ended up with a dry socket and the worst human possible pain you could have. So Yeah, and you wouldn't let me have my Vicodin freaking thieves. <laughs> you have to let me have like one Vicodin every 10 hours. Like, you're fine. He's fine. He doesn't need Vicodin. He's not in pain or anything. Anyways, uh, what does your mom think about you making money out of gaming? I think? I absolutely love that he loves what he does. And I'm um, sorry, that was my phone not yeah, turned get off. Out of your mom. <laughs> um, I love that I love that he loves what he does. I'm happy for him. I'm proud of him. He's a hard worker, always has been. This is he's doing what he loves, what he's passionate about, and that couldn't make me any happier. Yeah. Oh, you, actually, if you guys didn't, you should check out my 100K video with my dad. I did. I'll put an annotation above in case you guys want to see my dad's perspective because. My dad answered, you know, some of these questions with me as well, um, and it was a vlog, so you can actually see what my dad looks like, the TV and our dad, the man, the myth, the legend. Um, but anyways, next question is, how did your mom take the idea that you're not going to college? I'm sure people are going to love this one. Um, it, 
It was shocking. Well, I was and going to go to college at first. I was I was going to be a surgeon. That was like my thing. And I talked about this in like my hundredth video. But well, and what a lot of people don't know is that Preston, when he was 14, when he was 12 years old, he started putting together, I came home from uh, work one day and he had, we had bought this brand new computer. And back then they were very expensive. It was a single and core. So yeah, a single core, boo, his. It was boo, crap. Boo, his, his. Oh so I walked in and he had taken this computer apart and there were pieces all over the floor and I almost died, but I get my composure, took a deep breath, said, son, what are you doing? And he said he had decided he wanted to learn how to build computers. And so he had found college manuals on the internet and printed them off and there started his computer love. And when he was 14, um, he was accepted into a school and got his IT1 certification at 14. So he's already had college experience and college hours. Um, and so when he came to me and decided and said, Mom, look, he graduated a year early, for those of you who don't know. I graduated at 17. At like 17. right after, like literally, I graduated and then like, I turned 17 at the same time pretty much. Right. So I almost graduated at 16, which would have been awesome, but it, it yeah. was So he came to me and he said, hey, Mom, look, I want to decided I want to do this YouTube thing and blah, 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 blah. And it was like somebody punched me in the gut. And I was like, what, really? And I just couldn't believe that he decided he didn't want to be a doctor. He was very dead set on being a doctor and uh, contributing to society in that way. And um, But when you have, like, when life gives you lemons, you just, you make lemonade. And when they're yes. like, oh, you can play video games and make a living. Right. Well, that's not what it was at first. At first it was an alternate reality where I could get away and be myself and just have fun playing video games and streaming for people. And then it was like, oh, there's a possibility. Like, there's always that thought in the back of my head was like, oh, I have a possibility. Like, there's a possibility I could make this my living in the future. And I was like, well, why not go with that? Because I love doing it. So if it's possible, awesome. If it doesn't and I, you know, end up having to go on a different path, cool. But it ended up working out for the best. So... Yeah, I don't know. It's it's awesome. It's like having chicken and making chicken salad. <laughs> chicken salad's gross. Chicken salad sandwiches are good. Chicken salad is nasty. Anyway, so to answer your question, I was absolutely freaked out at first. I thought about it and decided, you know, I'm very supportive of my children. I trust Preston. We've raised him to make good choices. He's always made good choices. And um, except for, you know, minus a couple of months in his life. But other than that, he has always been very, very responsible. And we trusted him. We got behind him. We supported him. And, um, you know, turned out to be a great thing. So it was uh, it's pretty boss. Um, okay, okay. So, guys, actually, we're just, like, about to run out of time. Like, we've only answered, like, four or five <laughs> questions, and it's taken a long time. So I guess we'll, we'll do a part two video on this, and I'll upload that on uh, tomorrow, Sunday. Uh, so we've already got all the questions picked out for now. I think we answered, like, I, I don't know, like, five or something like that. Uh, the questions the next episode are pretty much going to be like all from Facebook. Uh, but anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And this is a little bit different, but I thought it would be a really good 200k uh, subscriber video. And my mom had to, you know, she had to take time. My mom's really busy, uh, so she had to take time out of her busy day to come and do this with me. So it means a lot that you guys, you know, watched, and uh, I appreciate it. So yeah, thanks, mom, for coming out, and we'll see you guys in episode two tomorrow. Yes, keep watching. Keeping our friends for the win. <laughs> oh my God, goodbye, guys. <laughs>